This time last year, the Boxers struggled to a 2-1 series win over Ireland, while they had then suffered a historic first ever defeat in Argentina. A year later, they are in a very different space, having now won five games in a row, while they have scored 35 points or more in each fixture. There is a very different feel to the box side of 2017, but they are now set for a litmus test in Perth. The next two matches in the Rugby Championship should provide a far clearer picture of just how far the box have come now that they get set to take on Australia and the All Blacks away from home. Since 1996 the box have struggled in Australia, losing 20 games, winning just 4 and drawing 1. However, this is a golden opportunity for the Springboks to secure a win in Australia. They have picked up plenty of momentum in recent weeks, while they have a settled side that is full of confidence. The biggest test for the box will come on defence, with the Wallabies having scored as many as 9 tries in their two test matches against the All Blacks, with Will Genia, Kirtley Beal and Israel Folau adding a real edge to their back line. However, the Buck Pack has been performing at the top of its game and they should look to target the Wallabies at scrum time where they struggled against the All Blacks. This is a game where you pick a win at your peril, but I reckon the box will achieve superiority up front while doing enough on defence to keep the Wallabies at bay. In the end, I'm backing the box to edge a win by about 5 points. Over in New Zealand, it should be a far easier game to call, with the All Blacks having gone undefeated in their last 24 games against Argentina. In addition, in the last 13 games between the All Blacks and Argentina in New Zealand, the winning margin has been an average of 36 points. The All Blacks would have focused intently on improving their defence after being shown up at times by the Wallabies. I expect this aspect of the All Blacks game to be far better against Argentina, while the attack is far superior. It should allow for a comfortable win of about 20 points.